Welcome back to Ask the Techies, I'm Dee Lee Beard, and in this episode I'm going to talk about the new iPad iOS 4.2, how to create folders and how that can be a valuable tool for you. On my iPad here you can see I'm really into news. I'm a news junkie. I've got gobs of them here. I've got the BBC News, I've got the USA Today, ABC News, CBS News, NPR, AP News, Time, all of those. Well, I'd like to have those all in one folder. It would allow me to have to do less swipe, 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 swipe to get to my other apps <laughs> so I can have things grouped. Right now I kind of group things by screen. I have a lot of games on one screen and another one. Now they've already kind of created that for you with a game center, but that's kind of a way to interact with other people with other games. In this case, you can actually create a folder for all your news apps. Let me show you how. What you do is you tap and hold and see how you get the X's. And of course, that's how you can rearrange your icons. You've done that before um, on the iPad. But this time, when you drag one over top of the other one, like this one over top of the ABC News one, I get this and it's called news. It automatically defaulted to news because that's the category this app is actually in. Now of course I can go in here and tap and decide I want to call it something else and I can say favorite news and then I can have another folder called uh, less used news or local news, whatever I wanted to do. I'm just going to close that keyboard. So there we go and then I can just uh, tap back and if I want to add others to this little folder, see now I have this little news folder and then I can choose which one I want. I want to add NPR let's say to it and pop it on there Tap AP in there, tap USA Today in there, oh I'm getting all of these in here, uh, BBC News, tap the, oop, BBC News, there we go, CBS News, there we go. Now I got all these news apps right there together in one place and I can even move it down there. And you click the button again to close it. So tap on it, there we go, there's all my news apps. Go in there, tap on it and I can actually start to load them. If I decide, you know, I don't think I really want the AP News anymore, then I can click and drag and just pull it out of there. And I can leave it on the outside because I access that one maybe all the time and I don't want to have to go into another folder in order to get it. But for those other things, like maybe you have several different apps you like to check weather with, you can put those, all of those into a folder. Uh, certain books, uh, book applications, like I have like that Peter Rabbit book, uh, Toy Story interactive books, I could put all those into one folder so my kids will be able to find what they're looking for on the iPad. Folders, great way to go, easy way to clear up some of the clutter on your iPad. Get yourself a little more organized with less swiping, 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 swiping. Thanks for watching.